I feel like the dude from X Men. Is X Men? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's Saturday, the store's busy, but that doesn't slow the hustle because Master Ian is always whipping in the kitchen. And right now, we got some more early birds. Ah, we, ah, ah, I feel go, like we've been forgetting We've been lately. forgetting to get The last two episodes, we forgot. They, the chicken dance counted as the bird call, and a lot of people liked my dance. I was a little embarrassed about doing it, no, but it came out really nice. That was cool. So maybe this episode, we overdo the early bird sound. To make, make up for it, just to make up for it. All right, so this one's early, but at the same time, we've done two episodes with it already, so we're not even really gonna go into detail. We're just gonna show you the colors of it and then just keep the ball rolling. So boom. Number seven of 50. As you guys know, it is still the same material concept as the other ones, Yep. which is the leather and canvas. This one's gonna be lime green, lime green cheese hole, Lime green insole. This one's actually kind of nice, right? With the I like, didn't realize that crazy. there's actually leather on the back of the tongues. That's my first time to notice oh. that. Every time. Leather on the back, if we haven't talked about it before. Now, the reason why I like this one a lot is because they did the same color lace to match the color that is doing for those three options. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's not exactly neon green, but it's still green. Because all the other ones, it's like a super a completely different, different color. color. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they went pastel, like a pastel it. green to complement the neon. Yeah, it's nice. Baby blue little hit, pink and blue marble. Nice, size five. Not much to say about that. Not much to say about these. How you feeling now? This one has no name. All three of them have no name. But these three musketeers come out sometime. <laughs> these three musketeers come out sometime in the fall winter. There's no release date and there's technically no name, but the rumored name for all three of them is the acid wash. Yes, sir. And it's to resemble the 1986, I would believe, or five. The 80s, OG, OG, 80s OG. OG vibes of the Dunk High. Yeah. So, and you can tell that's different. The, the main thing I that stood out to me was like this. They're doing this a lot lately. It's big, but do you notice how much bigger it is oh, than yeah, a regular it's definitely a lot thicker too. I have, I have the regular dunks on right now, but like, look how much bigger the actual sole is. Like, it's thick. Leather's tall. nice. Really, really, good leather. really, really good, good leather. leather. I was skeptical as how the acid wash would look in person. Yeah. I thought it was gonna look a little blotchy, but you can actually see it and tell that it does look like some old school acid wash yeah. on there. The other thing that stands out to me a lot is the shape. Look at the back. Like, how exaggerated is that? I didn't even notice that. Versus I really the had new, time to new dunk highs. Stare at all these. Versus the new dunk highs, that's crazy exaggerated. Uh, yeah, we... Q, Q, can you get us a dunk high? Any new dunk Just high? Any dunk high. Here we go. Wow, the leather difference is fucking crazy. Yeah. Now look at that. Look at the way it like angles in. It's like scoops in, and this one goes straight up. Right. That's just that that OG style of a uh, dunk high. Well, the pull tab is fucking yeah, crazier too. It's bigger. Look at the star exaggerations on it. Yeah. Look how more indent in around. Yeah. But look how much they're just poking out yeah. compared to the old ones. Mm -hmm. These aren't even like, you can't even feel they're them if you run your finger over it. And what's cool is how they're really taking it back to make it look exactly like the 80s. Yeah, the OG. Because back in the 80s, all the shoes were better. The leather was better. That's why yeah. you can that's why you can still find 85s and wear them. You know what I'm saying? You could find it. like a 96 or a 2001, put it on and it yeah. could fall apart yeah. Yeah. because of just the transitioning yep. to cheaper manufactured quality versus original. That's why the 85, what was it, like the reverse bread or whatever they did for All-Star Weekend uh, a year ago. And then the neutrals, the leather is, is more of a tough it's material like and not thick. so much of like a plastic yeah, yeah, kind of feel yeah, to yeah. it yeah. because they were trying to resemble Super the 85 leather, yeah. material. Yeah. So they did a really great job on that, but there is more. There's more because there's three different colorways. We have the whole pack. We have the whole pack. Let's go yellow. Boom. Oh, the other thing we didn't show on the other one, I want to say inside you got an extra lace. Yep. Yeah, I think they all come with alternate Mustard. lace. Mustard. <laughs> Same thing on this. This <laughs> sole is You know what I'm talking about. It. That's why Michael's smiling because it's from an old CKY video. Run that Mustard Man video real quick. Mustard Man. Mustard Man. <laughs> Same concept. Yeah. Really great job. Leather's still hitting. I like the colors. I like how the contrast of the yellow with the oxidized sole hits really hard. You know what I, I like how noticed? it's all different shades of. What's up? You know what I just noticed? The insole has Nike 
all over. I don't know if you can get it because it's so tight inside there, but it's there's Nike logos all over it. That's actually really tight. Right? I wonder if they did that back in the day on the old dunks. It's funny because I was looking at some old dunks on eBay when I was searching for like twos and threes and stuff, trying to get yeah. my, my 80s collection up. Mm -hmm. They had some like, I think it was like Kentucky or something like that, some older All styles. the old Be True pack? From, yeah, from the 80s. Bro. All the so old that was really cool. university pack. Because I want to say, maybe, maybe I should get you some might have so to, we can compare You might have to, to fact check me on this, but I'm pretty sure a lot of the original dunk highs were college colors. That's where the St. John's, the, the I Iowa I saw someone mention Iowa, like yeah. Iowa on this one. You know, I guess this would be UNLV. UNLV you know what I mean? So like, I want to say the original. Spartan. Spartan, like that, and that's why the new ones, they're all Because in the early colleges. 2000s, yeah. it was those schools that you just named. Syracuse, yeah. Kentucky, UNLV. And then I guess it kind of just kept it going with the Spartan, Michigan, yeah. et cetera, et cetera. Just kept going. This one's super cool. Same thing. Um, so far, if I had to choose between the two, yellow would be more yeah, of my color. Like to me, that that's the red one's the ugliest one. Yeah, the best oh, one. The, the best one's coming next. Yeah, the best one's next. That's the black and white colorway. I guess this is more, almost like a bleached. This one's sick. Yep. With the extra lace. Why? Because of all the colors they use. One, black and white's my favorite color. Two, that uh, tan, beige, off-white to go with the sole. I feel like the color of this sole I've never seen on a Nike before. Like this, gray. like weird, like it's a weird charcoal. gray. Though. It's, it's like, like a charcoal, dark, dark charcoal gray. Yeah. Stars still hidden, leather still the same, but color coordinated wise, color patterns, this was the best choice. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what school this would resemble if they were to put it to a school, because there's not a lot of information on these. They basically, are, wow, that looks really tight. You get that at all? It looks way better on the white. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, like look at that. So all of them are all over pattern like this. This one stands out because the other one was kind of color matched to the actual color. But look at this. It's got the overlap check. Yeah, the overlap check. We noticed though, the, the only one that was a little bit different was the yellow one. Oh, it's harder to do overlap because it's on black. Yeah. You can't even tell, but it's there. Yeah. So this one's the hardest to me. This yeah. is the one I could drip the best. Yeah, for 1, sure. 1,000%. I don't own a dunk high. It's weird because AJ1's my favorite silhouette. Yeah. So you would think You'd be able dunk to highs that. would be something that I rock with a lot. But I wore a lot of Ewings back in the day mm. and I just got so over wearing bulky top yeah. heavy yeah, yeah, shoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And with this padding on top, which is just comfort for you know yeah. skating or hooping, it just made it uncomfortable. You know what Michael has me checking on every shoe that comes in now? <laughs> under here, I like. Is yeah. there anything under there? Is there any hieroglyphics in there? <laughs> yeah. Is there anything? Is there a number on there? Right. The trophies are numbered on those. Yeah. Okay. So, what's your okay. favorite out of the three? For sure, this one. Okay. So, I'm gonna pull all three out real quick. Hey, yo, Larry. What's up, man? What's your? <laughs> 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 bro, Blue Gator just appears when you walk in. Look, bro. What you mean? You know what? You it have is. to <laughs> All right, what's your favorite one if you had a rock pat or walk okay. acid wash? And I'm why? glad you asked. This has this grayish tone to it. However, I love the way the yellowing looks with this colorway right here. So it hits harder enough, than the contrast of the other two you're saying? This, correct. This is a good contrast. I like this, but it kind of has UNLV vibes. As you know, I actually gave you a pair of the UNLV dunks. Wasn't really going for those for myself because yeah. of the gray. The gray. Wait, wait, How, yeah. This is like, I don't know, it's not so much a gray, it's like a- uh, White, um, white, yeah. white so and black. So really. I, I honestly, for the simple block scheme of this one, I think this is the one. This is, this I could put together a dope fit with, but usually you have to be very plain with the fit when you have a shoe that, that talks loud. this loud. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. This, I still like, you can still have a graphic tee on or still something, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. and it's and not, it doesn't, it's, doesn't yeah, look like too much. It so, doesn't look so like too much. I think we're all in accordance I, that this, it's one, two, three. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, so yeah, I think we're all, yeah. Okay, exactly all right, we well, that's, that's interesting. Yep. Nice, so I like that. Let's get the mullet on here. Yeah, Jesse. Jesse! Jesse! Let's get the mullet on. We gotta get the mullet. Joe Derte is in the building right now. Oh my goodness. Woo. Have you seen these in person yet? Nope. Okay. Just looking at these acid ones right now, I'll let you kind of, you know, look at each one because mm -hmm. I know you like to check the shoe out before and you hand it to Larry and we'll go in a circle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Boom. The shape of this one is, they're different. Yeah, like they're the gonna back? go. They're gonna oh, go the back more towards the down. '80s vibes with the real leathers, exact identical you know, shape to this. it, the thicker yeah, soles, this heel. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Switch. Now, after looking at all three, which one are you rocking with and why? Red one, because wow. It low key looks like a Freddy Cougar. To be honest, it kind of okay. looks like a Freddy okay. Cougar, but I like Freddy the colors. Cougar's the color blocking 
on the sole and this whatever this color is is like, a, gray, like a charcoal yeah. gray with the acid oh, i like it a lot more these ones are a little bit more like you're gonna have to dress for the shoe this one i feel like i can just slap on with some grays and some reds and i could be all right with this one okay. so i'll go for this all one right. that's nice, nice. Oh, all right. Right. Cool. 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 cool cool i do like the white one this would be this one this one and then the yellow one okay that's okay. that's the last question so he's got one two three Bam, that's Jesse's pick. Okay. I do like those though, they're okay. hella sick. Interesting, thank right. you, Jesse. Who Joe Dirt Better, man. Chino, come here. Chino, this fool's in the fajita meat. Get over here. <laughs> Get out of the fajita meat. Get out the meat. I can eat that, right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, eat that. All right, have you seen these yet? I saw those leak uh, like a day or two ago. But you haven't seen them in person? This is the first time in person. Okay, cool. Let's check them out. We're gonna do a little run through. Just kind of peep them, hand it to Ian when you're done. Dude, the leather is insane. Leather's though. nice. Leather's really nice. Good. Switch. Yo, and then they're doing the midsole. Oh, yeah, you the notice how it's soul. to the O and you're a vintage guy, so yeah. that's why like your thing. So that's your shirt. Yeah, look at that. Bro. All eyes on I don't me. know if the hat's yeah. vintage, but semi vintage. Semi oh, what does semi vintage uh, mean? It's like mid two thousands or early okay. two thousands, yeah. early two thousands, semi. Semi right. vintage. Semi. So I do now. think that this is probably okay. that's the, the one. one that I would choose out of all three. And why? I just like the neutral tones on this one right here. So it's just more easier for me to rock. Although I do like all the designs and this one right here, it has that UNLV, but also I got Freddy Krueger vibes as well from this. Yeah, that's so. what Jesse said earlier. And that's really weird that you just said that. Yeah, that is weird. <laughs> I didn't think that. I didn't, think, didn't think that. And yet both of y'all are blindly coming here, not talking that's about crazy. it to each other and both thought that. So. But now that they say it, I see now it. Now I see it yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Now it's like in my head. Yeah. This two right here on the tongue, the Nike, that's definitely vintage right here. Yeah. So yep. going back 1, to it. percent Old Nike logo. Yeah, this is so sick. I love these. Cool. Well, I don't want to interrupt your fajitas, so. All right. Back to get eating. Back to Peace out. You know what's interesting to me? Whenever I saw this pack for the first time, and even, I'll be honest, even right now, I don't like this pack at all. Whenever I posted it, people were going crazy over this, and I was like, really? What do you think? I'm going crazy over the other shit. That's what I'm saying, me too. Every time I see this, I just think Autobots. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bumblebee or whatever. Yeah. Let me tell you something. I won't mm. buy it. <laughs> that says a lot. Yeah. yeah, I'm not a fan of this pack, but. Okay, let's put these up. I am a fan. I, I might get one pair. I might oh. get these ones right here. Lastly, they're doing an 80s styles vintage box for it that looks like. Dookie. Doo doo. Splat. They're doing an 80s old VHS cassette box to replicate the sleeve that the VHS oh, tape the, goes in. For these? Yeah, for these. Wow. And so it's really tight. We have something special saved for you guys at the very end of this video. But next is going to be my personal favorite from this and entire In the most sought after one that they've been rumoring about since 2017. I can't think of a retro shoe that's been done like this before. Yeah. That's an actual retro. This material? Of this material okay. all over, because if you think about it, all the other ones weren't actual original. Like actual OG colorways. Actual OG colorways. Right, right, right. So a few of them have been floating around the internet, but we got one here to show you guys. Here you go. All patent bred AJ1. Now, like I was saying earlier, I can't think of another shoe, Royal, Black and White, UNC, right. Black Toe. I can't think of anything that's ever been all, all over patent. patent. That's an original retro. The closest thing was like satin, satin, but it's satin, it's, it's not satin. patent. I'm not gonna lie, whenever I first saw this, I wasn't a fan of it, but seeing these in person, they're actually kind of dope. So I will say, as we, you know- This is a must, to interrupt it? you. Like 1,000% a must for me, 1,000%. Same here. Same here? You too? Yep. <laughs> Gotta have it. <laughs> Gotta have it, I need it every time. I passed on the blue chill, kind of regret it, but- Really? Yes. Bro. I'm gonna have to get this. Patent. I'm gonna have to get. I'm just okay. Here. I don't like patents. I didn't like the metallic gold. I didn't like the black and gold. I didn't like why I don't the like UNC. I didn't like any of them. But here's my issue with patent. This colors are not. I know it one step and it's one just step like, and it's over. <laughs> why do you want that? One step and it's over. One crease, your whole shoe's done. Cool. Listen. No Shout problem. out to my boy Polly at Sneaker Shields. <laughs> yeah, really, that's all you have to do is sneaker shield it up. Because yeah. I have to get okay, a pair of the these. Only and even, I, look, exactly. when you have the folded crease and it's like, okay, that's just too much, which is how my Supreme Forces were yesterday. I came in here, I was like, man, was let me over. get some fresh forces. It was over for those. But with these, I think I can tiptoe, I can keep tip it light, and I think so, a little light. I agree with him. For me, joints. it's like this. When it starts getting that busted back, when the back starts getting <laughs> what? When the back starts getting bust busted out? up, <laughs> bust out the back. When, yeah, when you start getting the wrinkles out the back. Okay. Yeah. The wrinkles out the back. <laughs> no. 
when you start getting the push in on the uh -huh. toe, wrinkled so in the toe. Yeah, I don't like no, wobbly, when it starts so. wobbling right here, when you're not even wearing it, it dips way down inside here. No, but a simple crease across, and I'm only gonna wear these three times a year. Well, yeah. this is funny, because it's actually rem reminding me of a story from who I got this from. Obviously, on one of the episodes, we talked about how they get these out. Usually when it comes in a no box, it means it was stolen out of the factory, which also means there could be some bins and creases from them stuffing it and hiding it to get out of the factory with it in their in their possession. Right, right? Yeah. and they're all creased. Right. These look pretty good, right? Yeah. He had to stuff the shoe completely and let it sit for two weeks to get the patent wrinkles out. Our Travis, like our Travis High back there, they like, bows in a little yeah, bit because yeah. it was it just bent. bent for so it long bent. that it's yeah. just like bad. Even the Seafoam too was super bent, it but was. we're able to get that one yeah. off, someone yeah. bought it. Yeah. You yeah. know, some of the pairs are, you know, people understand what's going on and yeah. they, they don't care because they just want to be able to say, I had it first. Yeah. So I also made sure for him to pick out the best condition one to send to us because there were some that were gross. I mean, now that we're doing it on camera, you yeah. always want to have the best one. Yeah, but at the so same time, it's also good to show the people how these motherfuckers yeah. really come in. Yeah, yeah exactly, up. exactly. But this one's in great condition. I was condition. very surprised to see this in Let's this Let's talk about the family hit. Yeah. I don't really we know. Don't, we don't know. Behind this, what, what the theme, it, what the theme is. Yeah. I've tried his research a little bit of it. I can't find anything. The only thing they keep saying is October 23rd is going to be when they release. Uh, well, I don't have any friends. I got family. I'm a family. I'm a family. 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 Shut up, Vin Diesel. So look, if you're Vin, then I'm a... Uh, <laughs> Who are you? Uh, Paul Walker? I'm Paul Walker, <laughs> hey, dog. Paul Walker. <laughs> Dope. Need it. Doesn't come out till October. Cool part about this shoe is it's already sold. Bye. Straight off of the IG story. This to, is, to the homie. This, this is when uh, this is when stuff gets spicy now. This last shoe. Shit does get spicy. Might have a little uh, arts and crafts project we're about to do. Yeah, 1,000%. Give me answer. The prototype. AJ1 prototype. Nothing crazy about the shoe, um, except for one thing. It matches my Gatorade. <laughs> Fire. Okay. Well, what, so these aren't the prototypes. These are called the the blue Gatorade. The, the, the cool blue. Yeah. They already got a cool blue. They got a blue Gatorade. No. The, oh, it's no, purple one Gatorade. Gatorade. Yes. Yeah, and, and unfortunately, you would think. First of all, they didn't even make a cool blue. Nike, I need a cool blue Gatorade, Jordan 1. You're not that guy, pal, trust me. You're not that guy. These are pretty tight, I like these. And like we were talking about, this shoe is destroyed. You can see how <laughs> bent up this yeah, thing is. Yeah, you can see dude. it all in right here they, too. This thing has just been bent, it's folded, like, twisted. Like yeah. But, what they could have done to get it out easily is uh. cut. The top off. The prototype. Which is why it's called line. the prototype. Because in a prototype, there's changes to there's be changes. made. There's in a changes. There's changes we gotta make. And I think it's time that we make a change. Scalpel? Change. Doctor? Scalpel. All right, it's prepped and ready. Can I? Can you do one half? I want to do the other half. That's cool. That's cool. I, feel I just I've don't never, know. I've never cut gonna, a shoe before. These are like rinky, it's gonna go through. Rinky dink, scotch. Bro. Jordans are not that. Okay, fair enough. Listen. That's all you had to say. You didn't uh, have to yeah, finish. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, okay, let's try it. Like, this thing's going through. There's no going back after this. I don't care. But this color's the best colors but of the shoe. I don't That's know, the shitty but this part is, about this it. This is cool colors. Okay, I'm going like, in. All right, here. Do you need me to pull it or anything? Or? Maybe. Just hold it. Okay. Oh. You're going through. Come on. I'm going through fucking padding now. Yeah, this is the hard part. Yeah, this is where you get padding now. Oh, oh, oh. Just take it all the way. I don't care. I'm pulling as hard as I can to get it to stretch off. You still get a little bit of the blue on the top. That is oh, I can't believe we're doing this. I can't believe we're doing this. And there you have it. Oh, look at the little hits on the orange. Oh, the though. orange. Oh, so they did. Yeah, because the foam usually isn't orange. Orange guts. You feel me? I feel like the dude from X-Men. Is that X-Men? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it should go this way though because it's goggles. <laughs> no, 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 no. Laser off. Oh yeah, let me cut it. <laughs> Cyclops, I need your help. Wow, look what you did. Yeah. <laughs> look what you did. I knew my powers would come in handy one day. 
So do you supposed to just leave the floppy tongue? Yes, yeah, bro, that's, that's the, the vibe. vibe. That's the vibe. Yeah. Big flop. I think Sakai so. does it. Why can't we? Rick Owens vibe. Young Ricky. Yeah. The suede is so nice. I it'll, feel bad we just did this. It'll look real bro. nice sitting in the trash can once look, we look throw that, it away. It's got that color changing suede, bro. What do you do with this now? Put some laces in this part, and then you're just gonna like wear it bro. back around here oh. with two, with a separate lace. I'm gonna tell you what you do with this. Give me your, give me your oh. arm. We're just gonna get two laces. We're gonna tie it right here, mm. and you're just gonna rock it like that. It's hard. Blue Gatorade style. It's hard. Turn it upside down because the air. Oh, like that. Mm. Yeah, it looks better. And then yeah. the orange pops out. Hard, bro. I would, I would never. <laughs> I would never. Outside oh. cookies and cream. Inside tangerine. <laughs> you like that? I like those. Things. I was thinking hard. That was pretty good. I feel like riff Where's the right other now. one? He just made a Jordan Dunk. It's like a convertible. <laughs> it's a convertible dunk. It's called junk. It's called junk. <laughs> <laughs> okay, see this shoe? I see it. Okay, take a look at it. Tell me, do you like it? What's your first thoughts on it? First opinion. Okay. What do you like? I'm not much of a fan. Okay, now, would you like it if I cut the top off? I see that. <laughs> you see the lines? Yeah. Do you like it any better now? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I don't, I'm sorry. Did it make oh, it worse yeah. or better? Worse, bro, what you mean? Really? Stay yeah. with the high. No. Okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. Let's get Hayden in here. Yeah. Hayden! Hayden! What's good, what's good? Okay, okay, real quick. What do you think about this shoe? What are your thoughts? Do you like it? I like this color. Okay. Izzy, what's your thoughts on it? You just made the horrible fade. <laughs> what's your thoughts on it? Well, because it's just like... She kind of all over the place. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, like, like, and like, you got cream, you got like... You so got the, your blues, the blue's messing it up? Yeah, like, you got way. your neutral colors and then you have colors that's not okay, really as so neutral. so would you like it better if I did this? Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this reminds me of the uh, Sakai. Yeah, so look at that shoe. Look at the line. They're actually meant to be cut. Yeah, so you That's see the here, of the, of the there's shoe. a perforated line. I cut it off. Can you imagine that somebody cut the one side and keep the other one high? Oh, That's what's gonna happen. Oh, that's what's gonna That's happen. I know somebody really goofy enough is gonna do that. That's probably me. me. Oh, hey, hold on. Me. <laughs> I am cutting my biohack after one of y'all sent me that video. The biohack chopped off. So, are we gonna sell it like this? What, you get one, we just, just did this for the camera. Oh, this one. is just the test. You really around. finna cut the biohack? I might have to keep this. It'll look way better. Ooh, what's these? Can you cut these in half? No. What are those? Those are the acid wash dunks. Take a look at them. You've got three colorways, boys. If you could put them in order, one, two, three, where are you going? Uh, I think I'm gonna start off with my neutrals. This will be okay. first, Damn. and then red is kind of red and black kind of goes with almost everything. So this second and this third. Okay. That's so my that's, your, that's, that's my the Izzy list. Colors. One, two, three. This reminds me of, like some Freddy Krueger type vibes. So what is what going is on? Whoa. Uh, like, everyone keeps yeah, saying that. Um, I would go first. <laughs> this is like a little bit light on the bottom, so I'm gonna go second and then. Third with this one. Okay. okay, it's not too bad. You, I mean, we both had thirds, but nobody just, picked just the yellow for first. Yeah, everyone has. It's either those gone. two. Yeah. And yellow was always. Last. I just don't so like this one's so light at the bottom. If, well, if you this also got to think about color, the seasons as well. Hard. Like yellow ain't gonna play a big part in winter, is it? <laughs> Thank you, boys. Of course. All right, and for all the subscribers out there, do you guys prefer the Bentley Bentayga with the big back, or do you guys prefer <laughs> the drop top Cyclops? <laughs> <laughs> All right, well that concludes the uh, early bird special. Ah! Ah! And we out. No, 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 Scotty, this way. <laughs> <laughs>